In this demonstration, we will see how to configure a network address translation for a Stratix 5700 switch. Make sure that your switch is the right model. The switch here supports the NAT feature. Now go to NAT under Security in the Configure drop-down list. Check the Name box and click Add. A dialog box pops up. On the right, you will see the gigabit ports that you can access. Here, gigabit 1 is being used to access this NAT currently. We'll uncheck this box and open gigabit 2. Here, you will see the NATs that you can enable. Check the NAT you want to enable. Go to Gateway Translation and click Add Row. Specify the IP range, both public and private. The private range comes from the VLAN that your port will now access. Click Save. You can have multiple rows with multiple VLANs going up to the NAT. Now you need to add the devices that you will configure. To do that, click Add Row. Specify the public and private IP addresses. Select the type. You can select a range or the whole subnet also. Here we are selecting single because single is common in industrial instances. Similarly, add more devices. Specify a name here. Click Submit. Notice that the address has been added to the list. If you want to edit a NAT instance, select it and click Edit. These are the key steps to configure a network address translation for a Stratix switch.